Hey everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of adnexal hemorrhagic cyst. A young unmarried female patient came with right lower abdominal pain. Let's see what how it looks on ultrasound. On ultrasound, you can see a well-defined oval complex cystic structure with internal reticular pattern noted at the right adnexal region. The right ovary could not be separately visualized. This is a case of hemorrhagic cyst. Uterus looks normal from this section. Let's see some pictures of this case. This is the picture of the uterus in longitudinal section, looks quite normal. Here is the cystic structure with internal reticular pattern. The structure is about 3.2 into 2.9 cm in size. If you magnify the image, you can have a very good detail of the lesion. Now here is the magnified image of the lesion. I have used the zoom option of the machine. This is the adnexal cystic structure. You can see some fine hyperechogenic linear lines within the lesion, which are actually fibrin threads. We also call it the internal reticular pattern. On the right image, you can see some solid areas which suggest blood clot. With color Doppler, we found no vascularity within the lesion. The most adjacent vessel to the lesion shows moderate resistant flow pattern arising from the ovarian artery. This is the ovarian arterial waveform and you can see the resistive index is 0.59 which literally excludes the chance of its a common differential diagnosis ectopic pregnancy. This patient may be unmarried but we should exclude ectopic pregnancy in case of any adnexal cystic lesion. Now come to the summary. We have got a well-defined round to oval anechoic cystic structure with posterior acoustic enhancement and internal reticular pattern at the right adnexal region. The right ovary could not be separately visualized, so possibly this is of ovarian origin and color Doppler shows no internal vascularity. Moderate resistant flow of RI of 0.59 of ovarian arterial origin is noted adjacent to the lesion. Now the take-home message for this case. Color Doppler is a useful tool to evaluate the adnexal lesions, especially when you need to make a decision about benign or malignant hemorrhagic cyst or ectopic pregnancy. We'll discuss more about Color Doppler on our next videos. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon to get the notification for our next videos. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.